Hi and welcome students. In this Microsoft PowerPoint 2016 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add text to a shape. Let's get started. So you'll see here that I have a slide for manager showing. And let's say that I want this bullet point to be in a shape. Uh, a reason to do this might be to draw attention to a specific uh, word or phrase within your page. So I'm going to go right here and I'm just going to get rid of this bullet and I'm going to add the shape into my document. And so right here I go to the insert tab the illustrations group and I'm going to choose shapes. Now to add text to a shape all you need to do is start typing within the shape so it's pretty important that you choose the shape that could actually be typed in. For instance over here is the lines button if I click on the lines and I draw this line right here and then I try to type within it it's not going to let me. Lines don't allow me to type. Instead if I go to the insert tab illustrations group and choose a shape that's a little bit more blocky that has something in uh, an area inside for text something like a rectangle I could easily draw a rectangle and then immediately start to type let energy flow and there we go okay and so that's all you have to do to add text to your shape uh, keep in mind let's say that your shape does not already have any text in it you could always click on the shape and then start to type Okay. Now the cool thing about once you add text to a shape, you could actually edit that text size in the home tab, font group, size button, and you could actually format your text quite a bit within this font group right here. Keep in mind that the drawing tools format tab uh, mostly relates to the shape itself. However, there are some word art styles in the word art styles group where you can change the color um, and uh, outline of the text within the shape to something that fits your theme. So you could e easily change it within the word art styles group and you can change the fill, the outline, and the text effects that's, that are being applied. So one more time, the first thing you need to do is choose a shape that has a block or an area inside of it and then all you have to do is start to type let energy flow and you'll notice that the text will uh, automatically go down to the next line when you uh, when it reaches the end of the shape like it did right there so hopefully this video has taught you a little bit more how to add text to your shapes within PowerPoint 2016 if this video has been helpful for you please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel if you have any questions please put it in the comment section below thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video and have a great rest of your day